gentlemen, I have here the greatest attraction of all times. And I got it at the risk of life and limb. My adventure started one evening while I was enjoying a quiet cruise in tropical water. I was sailing before a refreshing breeze and making good headway. All at once, a fog blew up. It was so thick, you could cut it with a knife. And I did. And I found that the ocean had calmed down. And dawn was about to break. To my surprise, I found myself off the Gold Coast of Africa. I lost no time in going ashore. Having no further use for the telescope, I left it with a friend and continued my journey. I followed the trail for miles, enjoying the solitude of the jungle. It was a peaceful place. Not a soul bothered me. As the jungle grew thicker, I hired a native to help me on the journey. Now, if the truth be known, he was a lazy fellow for he soon tired of the job and deserted me. At this point, I didn't know whether to turn back or continue on. So I decided to toss for it. It was heads, so I continued. That afternoon, I sat down to eat the last of my provisions, Philly of soul. <laughs> it was a laughing hyena, but this was no laughing matter. Mind your own business. Just then, I saw a wonderful sight. Twas a pygmy elephant, no bigger than a hummingbird, drinking the dew from the flowers. I started to chase the little squirt when suddenly I changed me plans. The jungle was alive with pygmies, but I was determined to keep me head. Not knowing their language, I didn't know what they were driving at, but I soon got the point. But the murdering little devils soon surrounded me. The odds were against me, but I put up a desperate fight. Their heathen music. 
music. And then what happened? They shrunk me. And it's myself in this condition. I'm offering you for your sideshow. Baloney, you're an awful liar. 